Sometimes content projects don't turn out the way we expected them to. Maybe the content isn't engaging enough or it doesn't match the search intent, so it's not performing well organically. Don't worry, we've all been there. But how do you prevent content creation from going off track? With a content brief. Today, I'm going to show you how to create an optimized content brief in seconds with Copy AI that helps keep your content projects on track and sets you up for organic success. Now, before we jump in, what exactly is a content brief? A content brief is a set of requirements and recommendations that guides your team or your writers as they create a new piece of content. Now, a content brief is separate from a content outline. Typically, you want to create your content brief first and use that to inform your outline. Now, why are content briefs important? Well, jumping into a content project without a content brief is a bit like asking a contractor to build you a house with no sketch and no blueprint. You'll end up with the house, just not the house you want. And trust me, I've had my fair share of experience with contractors. <laughs> Content briefs help you and your team prevent free writes and reduce revisions, make sure you don't miss any critical information, gives your team clear direction, and if done right, should set you up to perform well organically. So let's dive in. The easiest way to get started is by using our prompt templates. Now you don't have to be a prompt engineer or a prompt expert to produce high quality content with Copy AI. You can get familiar with prompts by starting with any prompt template in chat. Prompt templates are prompts that the Copy AI team has created to help you produce higher quality outputs. Here, you'll find several prompt templates for content creation, SEO, and everything in between. These templates will help you and your team quickly create high quality content. So let's go ahead and click on content and SEO you'll see several prompt templates here. We wanna go ahead and scroll down until we find SEO content brief. Go ahead and click use prompt. Now all we need to do here is add in our primary keyword. For this example, let's use AI, have caps lock on, AI for marketing, enter. Now chat will return your primary keyword, but don't worry, chat is working in the background. Chat is actually scraping the search engine results page to determine what content types perform best for your primary keyword. Chat uses this data to recommend the content type you should create and includes other key information in the brief, such as the funnel stage, target audience, secondary keywords, jobs to be done, target word count, multiple working titles, an optimized slug for your new piece of content, and an optimized meta description. Now, if we scroll up, you can see what I just mentioned. Chat actually went out and searched your primary keyword and scraped the results and classified each result and recommended that you should create a blog post. And all the other information you need to create an optimized piece of content is here in your SEO content brief. In later tutorials, we'll show you how to use chat as a research assistant to add even more data into your content workflow. But for now, dive in, enjoy, and start creating your content briefs in seconds.